This year, Lake Mead's water level rose by three feet, but it is anticipated that it will fall this year, perhaps by as much as 20 feet. This decrease will expose a lot more of the lake's shoreline if it occurs. Due to its relative shallowness, the freshly exposed land will be noticeable in front of Boulder Beach. The biggest marinas at the lake are also nearby at Hemingway Harbor, which is where Boulder Beach is situated. The area was formerly known as Hemingway Wash, hence the name Hemingway Harbor. Aerial photos taken in the early 1930s, before the Hoover Dam underwent extensive construction, show this wash plainly without any water. The wash may be seen winding around the south end of what is now known as Rock Island, next to Big and Little Boulder Islands, and finishing up at the old Colorado River course in the photographs displayed on the screen. Due to the low water, these three named islands are once more completely united. This raises the question of how shallow the area is now and how shallow it will be later this year between Boulder Beach and Big Boulder Island. The aggregate classification plant, which would sift the rock used in cement, was built here by six companies. In order to do this, water had to be piped into a massive clarifying tank that was constructed on what is now Big Boulder Island. During the 1930s Hoover Dam construction, this 110-foot-wide, 15-foot-deep structure served as a settling basin for sediment-filled Colorado River water. The river's murky water was pumped into this basin, and when the silt had time to settle, pure water was rooted 130 feet below to the gravel screening area to wash the gravel required to create concrete. 